Well, good afternoon. Uh, it's going to be a, a review of um, this little chap I've got in my hand here, which is the Inky Falcon Plus and the GoPro 10 that I bought. Yes, I've been spending money and I've just bought this little setup. Really nice. Really, really, really nice. Um, the original Inky Falcon wouldn't take the media pod on the GoPro. Um, but they brought out the Plus, which does. So that is doing that. And it works really well as a gimbal. It will also connect to the um, GoPro. So if I switch this on, well it is on, but if I had the Wi-Fi on on the, on the GoPro, it would have automatically started the, the GoPro as well. Um, and uh, you have record buttons down the side here. Let me move a little closer. There we go. So we have top one is photographs, middle one is your video, the bottom one is a time lapse. Um, so you can switch it to what you want. On the back, it's got a thumb joystick, shall we say. So you can point it every which way but what. The M button sets which mode you want it in. So I'm not doing a full review on this. Um, there's plenty of people done a full review on this. So if you want to see that, pop off to their channel. Um, but I, this is just showing you the, that I've got one and I think it's absolutely brilliant. It really works well. Um, the little red dotted button is the one to switch on and off. Uh, on the other side, you have another button which resets it. So if I give that three presses, it will now send it into selfie mode so I can talk to it. Two presses and it should bring it back. And it reset, you can reset it with that as well. So yeah, it's quite a nice little, nice little gimbal, it really is. I'm going to do a little walk um, now and, and see, um, so you can see what it's like and how steady it is but it really is I mean it really does keep it it steady I have turned the um, one on on I have turned the one on the GoPro off so that's not on um, but uh, just using the gimbal so yeah there we go Let's go and see what it's like and I can also put the radio mic on here because on the back of the GoPro now um, let me switch that off there we go of course I'll be fighting it otherwise so on the back of the GoPro 10 um, I have the medium mod on, on it um, and that fixes fix oh the teeth don't want to work today fixes into the um, USB-C port on the camera which then gives you these three ports here so we have an audio port at the bottom we have a USB-C a USB-C in the middle and the top one is a video out so uh, yeah um, I just got a microphone on top which will which you can set from back to front if you want it so yeah it's quite a nice little uh, device I will run the audio on this um, to see what it's like so let us switch the GoPro on like that there we go and, and the only thing I've got to say about these GoPros these, this new one this 10 it, it does like eating batteries mm, okay but um, yeah so uh, this has got the do excuse me anti-shock off um, and the sound is on yes right so it's recording right so I should go and have a little walk around with this now and um, you will see what it's like when I come back now it's recording there we go 
Okay, so we're just going to have a little wander around. Should we have a wander around the pond first? So yeah, and uh, just see what it's doing. I think we've had a nasty tack of the rabbits here. Um, whoops, let me send you the right way. There we go. Look, nasty tack of the rabbits. Uh, <laughs> I really have. Um, but yeah, this is our old pond. Um, as you can see, I'll get used to this joystick in a minute. It's all right. Uh, really all over the place. Yeah. So, this is me walking about, and I'm not on level ground here, it's all over the place. I hope I'm not all over the place. Um, so yeah, this is our new pond, which uh, is looking rather nice. It is becoming established, um, as you can see. I'll stand still and move that way up, or I may have to move in my arm for That's okay. So yeah. yeah, let's go for a walk a little bit further, shall we? Just to uh, see how this does. Considering I am really walking over rough ground. Uh, it's up here or down down this bit here. And not in a nice way. So uh, there we are. We'll just walk along here a bit. Um, so let's do the let's do the selfie bit, shall we? So there we go. Now you should be able to see me. I think because I can't see me. There I am. <laughs> okay. So uh, I'll do away a bit. There you are. Um, it uh, it's quite good. And we're walking along. Lovely day today, by the way. Just put your back that round that way. There we go. It's a lovely day today. Really is. Um, it's warm. Surprising. The winds every now and catches you, but it's uh, it's quite a nice. I suppose most spring, isn't it? Well, according to this tree, look, it's. It, it, it's it's spring blossom out on this uh, I think it's a miniature plum this one uh, if I remember rightly uh, so yeah well now the sun's gone in I'd have test the camera won't it so I can straighten myself out a bit there we go uh, yeah so yeah there we go this is on a nice even path that I'm walking on at the moment so not really doing it justice is it so uh, let me walk the loop yeah okay so let's walk a little faster so uh yeah put a spring in your step as they say and i'm just walking normally um nothing nothing spectacular now what i will do um right now is I will stop and stop recording so what I've done there is I've I've switched on stabilization in the camera even though it's only standard stabilization um, but they call it actually hyper smooth in, in this camera so uh, It's um, hyper smooth. <laughs> oh, it's just weird. I've still got my radio mic on. Oh, it won't hurt. It won't be chatting to anything, that's for sure. So, yeah. Right. Now we'll just do a short left hand down of it. I'll go off here. Do the woodland walk. Change your arms. It's not a well. It's not a heavy setup um, to hold, but uh, 
it um it makes my old arms ache for a laugh a bit. <laughs> oh dear. Drawers are getting old. Yes. Okay. <laughs> let's let's bring you back round to me. There we go. There we are. Um as you'd be doing salvage, you could do with a slightly longer pole on. Um, I'm having to hold my arm quite a way out. <coughs> um, so yeah. Uh, <laughs> it does work because I, I should have brought my other camera with me. And you can see that, they, that I am sort of wandering around a bit. But the camera is really staying focused on me um, so yeah uh, sorry I keep looking down but I want to see where I'm going right back to the pathway so you will see um, where I'm walking and I've got you now uh, roughly height should we say so uh, you're projecting just out in front of me um, and uh, it's, uh, <laughs> it's quite fun yeah I reserve does have its uses some days for <laughs> doing things, especially when there's nobody in. Um, there's one couple just come in. So I think there's been uh, two, three, four, five of us in today uh, through the um, um, course of the morning. So I oh know there's another one now just wandering in. So, uh, I have to cut this bit here. There we are back in the, uh, the pond area after our little walk around. And we shall see uh, what this chap does. So, uh, yeah. Good thing about the GoPro is the front screen is live all the time. So you can see yourself what you've been recorded on my Osmo action. DJI Osmo Action, um, which uh, oh, is a lovely little camera, it really is. Um, but uh, uh, you, you get these new toys, don't you? So, you know, yeah, occasionally. Uh, and the good thing about this is the, the actual gimbal comes with a tripod feet as well, all part of the package. So, you've got the feet, the gimbal, absolutely brilliant. They're the downside, and there's always a downside, isn't there? Let me turn that one off. I don't want that one going. Right. Shake it down completely. There we go. Turn the gimbal off. Now, the downside I found of running with the media mod on the gimbal is I have to, to change a battery, take it all apart. Now, that's the only downside. I have to, as a, I, I've just got a, a, a screw they provide um, to put it on here. Say for having that big knobbly one, you've got this little lightweight one in here. So you need the Allen key to take that off. You've got to take, then take the media mod off the camera to change the batteries. A bit long winded. Now you can power it from the USB C port. So you can have a wire coming out of there. Um, powering it. I've not done that yet to see if it, how it works uh, and I believe somebody said you could actually power it from this unit this USB on the side to uh, charge batteries and they do say that it is reversible so if you've got a camera on here um, it will actually charge the camera um, whilst you're using the batteries in this and these batteries last for, for I forget how long it is ridiculous amount of time for a, one of these things um, so yeah, all very good. So there we go. 
There are no toys. Um, on a lovely sunny day. Um, and I hope you've not got the sun shining in your eyes. So I just realise it's behind me. Um, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the little bell icon when you have. And you will get notified each time I put a video up. But there you go. Stop me waffling, as I say. Thanks for watching. And bye for now.